I've got three words for you. Any human heart. Oh, that was really like my favourite TV miniseries oh, of all. Like broke my heart into tiny little pieces. Oh, I'm so pleased. What a lovely thing to reference. So wonderful. And, and I was thinking back to it, obviously, today. And it's you were with uh, Matthew McFadden. Matthew McFadden. And look what's happened to the both of you. I know. Oh, well, I've worked with him three times. I, but you, I'm so... Um, I'm so sort of overwhelmed by his talent. I remember, I think it was after two times of working with him, I remember saw him at an event. And I was like, oh my God, there he is. And I walked up to him and was like, hi, Matthew. Um, I'm Hayley Atwell. I work with you on Any Human Heart and how it, And he was like, why are you being weird? Like, we've worked together many times. But it, you kind of forget because it, he's so he's so talented. And I still get starstruck by, by people when I meet them. I was in a lift with him once and I was kind of in awe. I was a big fan of Ripper Street as well. So I didn't say anything, which I regret to this day. But I'll catch him. He's a gentleman. Him. He would say hi back. From one incredible leader man, to probably the most the, incredible leading the man. The leading man, yeah. You guys have incredible chemistry. Oh, good. Yeah, uh, good. But is that harder as an actor when you're working with someone who's so blooming recognisable, had so many like iconic roles and movies, is it harder to kind of go, you're this pretend character that my pretend character knows kind of thing or is it easier anyway? well he he demystifies it he disarms you when he meets you he's he's not like he's not going to try and intimidate you doesn't need you know he's tom cruise and so what he, he does is he makes people feel very comfortable and safe when you start working with him and i think that means that i can you know you, he, he wants you to relax so you can do your best job but also if you do find you have a starstruck moment he'll Embrace that. You know, I remember being on it in the car with him at one point, and we'd been working together for months. And I'd been sat in the car, handcuffed to him in this little Fiat 500, and the the camera was being reset. And I took a bit of a moment, and I suddenly went, "You're Tom Cruise," and he went, "I know, isn't it? I know, isn't this wild?" And I was like, "Yeah." He he's contagious like that. Like he's very enthusiastic. And at, at one point, I was like. I'm in a Tom Cruise movie. And he went, no, I'm in a Hayley Atwell movie. I'm like, oh, you charmer. You know, he's, it's, he always wants to give the power back and the confidence back to the people that he's working with. And he will actively do that until you feel like, actually, I'm here for a reason. I'm here because I was hired because they know I can do this. So let's not play small for the sake of it here. Let's actually step into this and lean into this because he needs me present. He needs me competent. He wants to make sure that I'm giving 100% because he is. And that trust is integral to our chemistry and integral to be able to actually drift around the streets of Rome and not damage anything. Well, you fully deserve the power in this movie. You're fantastic in it. It's a great movie. You're great in everything. And it is lovely to meet you. Finally, after all these years of holding that programme so like high in my, uh, in my own regard.